In this super quick video tutorial, I will show you how to take advantage of a new feature on Google Sites called Custom Teams. You have several ways how you can make your website built with Google Sites completely unique and no one will ever guess that you have used free website builder to create your site or your landing pages. One of them is to use custom HTML embed codes on your site. In just a second, I will share some of these codes with you. And another one is to use custom teams. Google recently updated this feature on Google site and added custom teams. So to get started, let's click on this plus icon here. When you come on the sidebar on the teams and then you see custom teams here, click on the plus icon and then you can give your team a name. Let's say I want to use black and white colors on this team. So I will call it black and white. Now you can add a logo straight away here and add a banner image as well. So let's say I want to add a banner image by uploading file from my computer then click on the next and you can create a team preset colors now you have option to choose one of the preset color teams google already offering you right here or you can add custom colors by typing the color code or selecting it from here if you think that you are not so good by selecting colors that match each other you can use a website called colors.co and then if you click on generate right here you will see color combination if you press the spacebar every time you will generate a new palette and then you can just copy those codes right here and paste it on your google site just like that now as i said i will want to use like black and white so i will just select dark color right here then i will set this one as white and use some grayish tone right here so once you have set your colors click on next again and then you can choose any font you want for your site let's say i would like to go with this one and choose medium and then as well for the body text on your site pages for the text areas then let's go and select maybe this one once you have select your font click on create team once you have done that you will see you have more options to set up your team completely now if you click on the colors you see your styles that you have set up right here for the text as well you have options of changing your text default size format aligning and spacing as well then if you go down you have images of the header we previously uploaded adjust for readability you can off this feature right here you see the image will be displayed in its full colors then you can anchor your image by clicking on these buttons and position your headers image again you can upload logo and favicon from right here now for the navigation tab if you come here you can see the color when scrolled you can make it transparent at the top if you off this you can see how your uh, header will look like i like it to keep it as a transparent and then selected page when you have pages on your navigation you can select do you want them to show bold on navigation top underline it or background color or foreground color so that depends let's go ahead i will put one page here call it about us And then if we go back on the team and customize this team and you see on navigation and then you have selected page now it shows just black and bold because bold is selected right here if you click on background color you will be able to see very clearly which page you are it helps with navigation on your site and then again you have options right here to change the colors again maybe you want to add some sort of shading and selected page color is black you can change it here if you want it for example if you click yellow it will show yellow right here so as you can see you have a wide range of options how you can customize your team so it will make your site absolutely unique now if you click on a component again you see your styles here you see style of the button right now button is a field out outlined uh, with the text button everything is black so if you go and insert here and click on a button to see a right preview how it will look like call it button about us again 
and link it to home page for example click on insert so you see you have a black button with the white text now if you go back on your team you can change color here maybe you want it to be red it's outlined it's text button now the same applies to divider i like using divider in between the sections on my side so currently it's transparent with a line weight of two if we set up line weight of five and choose the color to be black and then go insert divider you will see how it looks like okay so now before you didn't have this option to create different uh, lines and different styles of your divider i find this feature very helpful now again you can change color of your links displaying on your site and image carousel dots so everything now comes as a black because those are the main colors i set up for my site right here okay you can again change it from here so here it is you have done your custom uh, team it will be saved with the name you give it to and you can create it more and more teams like that and it will just make your site look completely unique and save your time and you don't anymore need to use preset teams from google and you know if you choose one of these teams right here it might be somebody who know google site who can tell straight away that you have used a uh, free website builder such as google site and nothing is wrong with that but if you create your own custom team your site will become completely original and unique so to edit your custom team you can click on these options here and you can edit you can duplicate it you can remove it from this panel right there if you duplicate it you are making copy of your team and again you can go ahead here and edit it again too and then it will just save as another team so if you come back here now you will have now two teams one of originally just created and then you have a copy again so if we for example now would like to add some text you will see how this applies now let's paste some text to see how our team applies so you have a black text in the font you have selected and then from these options right here you can change the style okay and that's how it works now as i said the other thing you can do to make your sites look very unique is to use embed code feature by embedding a custom html you can place different element that will make your site looking more attractive so i have done a custom code for you so if you would like to use this kind of a contact or subscribe forms or a custom html buttons with the hoover effect or perhaps you are doing e-commerce on google sites and you would like to display your products with uh, such an effect like this or embed some social media buttons all you have to do to assess these uh, codes are go to the page which is a code a landing dot meritmastering.com slash request dash code dash tutorial and you will land on a page like this where you have to enter your email address and then you will be able to download all these codes i just show you so once more the url you need to head to is a landing dot meritmastering.com slash request dash code dash tutorial another great thing what you can do to make your site looking more appealing is to use some custom designed images elements on your site or custom design background to do so head to the site called canva.com and canva have loads of stock media you can use on your site it's very easy drag and drop features to design custom backgrounds and elements for your site you can assess canvas a free stock media but if you would like to explore all the pro elements on this site i will leave the link in the description so you can try it out free for 30 days it's another great way how you can make your sites more appealing and unique that's it for today's video if you would like to learn more about all the insert elements on google sites how to set up your pages how to do all the settings here and including sharing options we have done a plenty of video tutorials on this channel feel free to browse our playlist for google site tutorials if you enjoyed this video click the like button if you would like to see more content like this click the subscribe if you haven't done it yet and if you click the notification bell you will be notified whenever we upload new videos and we do so every single week thank you so much for watching now go ahead and watch this video as the next one and i will see you there